Just imagine this. You have just finished filing your taxes and you are looking forward to receiving a sizable refund. However, you are confronted with an unexpected problem code. Panic begins to set in, your heart falls, and a million questions flood your head all at the same time. The meaning of this code is unclear. Is there a possibility that the Internal Revenue Service will conduct an audit? Will your return be reduced to a negligible amount? Dear viewers, there is no need to be concerned since in today's captivating investigation, we will be revealing the mysteries that lie beneath IRS mistake codes and tax transcripts. We invite you to accompany us as we begin on a voyage into the maze of tax files, deciphering the cryptic messages that leave taxpayers feeling confused and concerned. Hello, everyone, and thank you for tuning in to Stimulus Updates, your go-to channel for the most recent news and updates on various economic stimulus packages. Let me introduce myself as your host, Ali, and I'm excited to tell you about some recent developments that have occurred. Nevertheless, before we get into the changes for today, be sure to click the button that says subscribe and make sure the notification bell is turned on so that you are never left out of the loop regarding anything that has to do with stimuli. During these trying times, we are here to keep you informed and to give you the power to make decisions. What's up? Let's get right down to business. Today marks the beginning of a voyage of enlightenment, during which we will explore the mysteries that lie behind these mysterious numbers, which frequently cause taxpayers to scratch their heads in perplexity and concern. Think about this. I know the fact that you have diligently filed your tax return and are anxiously anticipating that long-awaited reward. You have been greeted by an unexpected error code. Your heart begins to drop, a sense of terror begins to take hold, and a plethora of questions rush your head. Could you please explain the meaning of these codes? Are these omens of impending disaster, indicating that an audit by the IRS is on the horizon? If you receive a refund, will it be much less than you anticipated? Do not be concerned, however because we are here to serve as your guides through this complex labyrinth of tax codes and transcripts. With the help of this in-depth video, we go deeply into the meaning and significance of IRS error codes, providing you with the knowledge and expertise you need to successfully traverse the difficult landscape of tax files. With that out of the way, let's get down to the meat of the issue. The first step on our journey is to investigate transaction code 150, which is a significant milestone in the processing cycle of the Internal Revenue Service. The presence of this code indicates that your tax return has been submitted and that your tax liability has currently been determined. It establishes the groundwork for subsequent calculations and determinations concerning your tax refund or the amount of tax that is owing about you. But what happens when something that was not expected happens? Error code 570 a new encounter has occurred. This code, which is suggestive of problems in return reconciliation, has the potential to throw a wrench into the process of reimbursement, resulting in delays and uncertainties. However, you should not lose your composure because a solution is within your grasp, even if it requires some patience and perseverance. As we move on, let us cast a light on error code 846, which is frequently praised as the ray of hope for taxpayers who are waiting for their refunds. The presence of this code indicates that your refund, which is actually your overpayment of taxes, is on its way over to you. In spite of the difficulties associated with paying taxes, this is a moment to rejoice since it is a confirmation that your efforts to improve your financial situation have not gone ignored. Our path, on the other hand, is not going to be all rainbows and sunshine. Error code 420 is on the horizon, which casts a shadow over the possibility of audits or additional examinations by the Internal Revenue Service. However, there is no need to be concerned because this code does not necessarily indicate that disaster is on the horizon. 
This is only a notification that your return has been marked for additional inspection, which is a preventative measure taken by the Internal Revenue Service in its pursuit of truth and fairness. And it comes to the dreaded math mistake reference number 9921. This classification notifies taxpayers of mathematical errors that have been discovered by the Internal Revenue Service, which then causes automatic modifications to be made to their tax returns. In spite of the fact that it is unnerving, it serves as a reminder that even the most scrupulous filers may experience obstacles along the path of paying their taxes. Nevertheless, there are instances of clarity and confidence that can be found in the midst of the sea of data and regulations. Take, for example, Tax Topic 151, which serves as a beacon of light in the turbulent realm of tax adjustments and offsets. When it comes to negotiating the complexities of stimulus payment adjustments and return reductions, taxpayers can use this article as a roadmap. Even though it is intimidating, it provides significant insights into the intricate processes and procedures that are followed by the IRS. Let's go on to the next tax transcript code which is 152, an array of light for those who are struggling through the chaos of filing their tax returns. When you see this code, it indicates that your return is being reviewed, which is an essential step in the Internal Revenue Service's pursuit of accuracy and integrity. Rest assured that your financial matters are in good hands, even though it may cause a delay in the processing of your refund. As for the possibility of an audit by the Internal Revenue Service, what about the elephant in the room? Tax Code 421 provides a glimpse of light in the midst of the uncertainties, so there is no need to be afraid. The presence of this code indicates that your audit has been completed, which marks the conclusion of a challenging leg of your journey through the process of submitting your taxes. Take comfort in the fact that your financial matters are now in order, despite the fact that the procedure may have been difficult. On top of that, let us not overlook the priceless insights that are offered by Tax Topic 203, which serves as a guide for individuals who are navigating the difficulties of refund offsets and adjustments. In this discussion, the complexities of claims made by injured spouses are brought into focus. There are a number of financial issues that could have an effect on your refund, including child support responsibilities. Although it is intimidating, it provides vital insights into the complexities of the methods and regulations used by the IRS. There are, however, instances of clarity and resolve that can be found in the middle of the complexities and uncertainties. Those who are struggling to navigate the complex procedures and protocols of the Internal Revenue Service, IRS can find a glimmer of hope in Tax Code 571. It is a credit to the dedication and perseverance of taxpayers who navigate the complexity of tax